Early stages of the second set here. Kyler in the opening service game, leading one set to love. 6-1 in the first set for Kyler. 15 all. <laughs> Just wide there. Big, big wide serve there from Kyler. Oh, and a double fault there. A little bit of an early opening here for Shane. After that first set, he'd like nothing more than take this opening game. Get a break to start off the second set. <laughs> no, just your racket. <laughs> that was the racket of Samantha Lee <laughs> playing in our women's final coming up in a little while. A great shot there by Kevin. Angle and depth on that shot. Shane barely able to get a racket on it. 30 all here. That's a big shot from Kevin. A little deceiving. It didn't look like it was, but it was deep and heavy. Shane struggled that. Set up the whole rally there. Kevin's fought back here from 5.30 down to leading 40-30 and a game point. Chance to hold serve here to start off the second set. Nichols would probably want that return back. Didn't really need to go to the slice forehand there, but he did put in the net. One game to love for Kyler here. Nichols now in the close side here in the camera, trailing one set and one game to love here. It's a fairly breezy day out here at Deer Lodge. Just another factor that the players are having to contend with. The sun coming in and out a bit. But the wind staying pretty steady. And double fault there from Shane Nichols. Nichols struggling to find his rhythm on the serve here. A 
couple odd shots in a row there. I think maybe the wind had a little bit to do with that point. Nichols took a bunch of pace off of one forehand. And then Kevin put a, a rare forehand slice from him into the net. You can see the women's final just now warming up on court two. Samantha Lee in your picture there. Taking on one of our juniors. Oh. A little bit of a fall next door in our uh, wheelchair game. I think everyone is all right out there. Sam's just working his way back into the chair, I believe. Couple. Or maybe we've had a, I'm not sure if we've had an injury or we may have had a equipment failure with the uh, wheelchair perhaps, but it looks like Sam has a backup. I think. I believe so. He has a new chair and he is ready to go. Everything's good on court one. Back to the men's final here, men's open final. Bit of a distraction there. We're sitting at two games to love here for Kevin Kyler. Hoping everything's okay over on court one. I think it is. I think we just had a problem with one of the chairs though, but Kyler with the two game to love lead here. Looking in full control. Great down the line shot there from Kevin. Oh, fantastic looking lob. Shane doesn't move in though, but what a great defensive lob there from Shane Nichols. Kevin looked like he had the rally all won. Good defensive play there.
good attacking tennis there from Kevin. Very difficult to tell which direction he's going to hit it compared to most players. A lot of the time, you don't know if he's going to go wide cross court or go down the line. It's hard to get an early jump on the ball a lot of the time. Game point here for Kyler, I believe. No, a double fault. Not happy about that. Crowd trying to cheer on Shane here to see if he can break and get himself back on level terms here in the second set. Sun coming out again. We had a big rain overnight. Thunderstorm, lightning storm. Didn't affect any of the play here at the Deer Lodge tournament. Served just long there from Kev. 30 all here. Great shot there from Shane Nichols attacking the second serve of Kevin Kyler. Oh, and that's a break. We had the wrong score. Beg your pardon. Break of service there. The first of the game. First of the match for Shane Nichols. He's now trailing two games to one. Back on serve here in the second set. Kevin Kyler, our top seed, winning the first set six games to one. As quickly as the blue sky came, a huge set of clouds coming in quickly right above the Deer Lodge Tennis Center here. The wind quite breezy out. Might not be able to see it at home, but very breezy. The clouds come in very quickly. I don't know where. Let's hope it doesn't bring any bad weather with them. You're going to see those clouds coming into your picture any moment. You can see mostly blue sky above, but the prediction is about 